Sabrina. Hi, Sabrina. Hi. Good to meet you. Hi. What is, what's this thing? Oh, this thing here, this is our PT6, Pratt & Whitney PT6 turbine engine. We use this to start this engine up and we do it as if we're testing an engine in the real world. You wanna come in and have a look at the shop? Okay. Good. It's right this way. What are these guys over here doing? You've been on an airplane, haven't you, Sabrina? Yeah. What do you think's running the aircraft? Keeping you warm, you're drinking your coffee, I know you're having your little <laughs> latte, watching a movie, right? Oh yeah. Yeah? What's doing all that for you? The engine. Those engines. So we don't want them to quit. These guys are, do are simulating an overhaul right now. I'm so confused again. Oh. <laughs> These engines to do an overhaul are in the vicinity of a million dollars. So it's very critical that we do it right. Yeah, I would say so. I would say so. Matt, this is Sabrina. Hi. Hi. What All he's right. doing here is uh, he's going to balance a compressor wheel, getting it ready for installation. Have fun. All right, so the first thing to do here is you can't touch it with your hands, so I've got a pair of gloves for you to put on here. Okay. They're white cotton gloves. We have to weigh each of these blades. Every blade is a different weight. And if you have all the heavy ones on one side and all the light ones on another side, then whenever it's turning, it's going to be lopsided. And you don't want that whenever it's running at 33,000 RPM. What are the white numbers on the blades for? It makes it a lot easier when we're going to find out which ones go where. Now what we're going to do is we're going to sort these. Perfect. So this is where the very heaviest one goes, and then the next heaviest goes directly opposite it. Then after we do this, we put rivets in so that the blades don't fall out, and we would test it out. Looks good. Would you fly in this, in an aircraft that has an engine with this in it? Feel comfortable? I guess so. Would you, Matt? I wouldn't trust it. <laughs> you mean perfect. Thanks, guys.